So the Lord did something amazing in the city of Nairobi. Can we lift our hands just for a minute? And just, just for one minute, just for one minute, one minute, one minute. Let's touch heaven right now. There's a new movement coming, the Lord said, in the city of Nairobi. And God said the outpouring will happen. He said it a year ago, but now it has touched down and it's moving all through the land. And the Lord began to say, it's not just for Kenya, but it's also for all of East Africa. East Africa is becoming a central headquarters in the spirit for something new. All of the nations here, but it's like Nairobi is the capital epicenter. And God is bringing leaders together. And things are happening and miracles are going to begin to happen. And I, I want to tell you, the, whole, the Holy Ghost said this is going to be the day of the mega church. Mega churches are going to rise. People are going to go from hundreds to thousands and thousands to tens of thousands. And believe it or not, tens of thousands to hundreds of thousands because and beyond. God said he wants big churches like that here. Can we lift our hands? Can you envision this? Not like you, you won't just see it only in Nigeria or America. But the day of the mega church in Kenya is going to be amazing. God is going to do it. The second thing he said, another thing he said was, whoever stands against this movement will fall down and not get up again. The Lord is going to protect his own movement. This time, they fought it before, but this time they're not going to get away with it. And then the Lord said, economic breakthrough is coming. Lift your hands if you need some economic breakthrough. New houses, new vehicles, new businesses. I, I feel the Lord saying there's mantles falling upon people to do business. It's going to be an amazing movement economically. How many are ready to leave poverty in your past and move forward into prosperity? Lift your hands just for one minute. I just wanted to touch heaven right now. Close your eyes and lift your hands and pray in the Holy Ghost. Father, we thank you for the touch of heaven upon the people. The Lord says, I've come with my deliverance power. I'm coming with my fire to your house. I'm coming myself to your house. If your heart is toward me, the Lord says, I'm coming. I'm coming to you, and I'm going to empower you. I'm going to bless you, my son, my daughter. I'm going to cause my favor to come upon the people. You're going to begin to see such miracles. The day of evangelism has come back. The day of miracle working has come back. The day of mass revivals has come back. The day of thousands of people that you can't count coming to events has come back. The Lord says, get ready for it now and plan and prepare for it. As if there's no obstacle, there's nothing in the way. The Lord says, if your heart is with me and your hand is in my hand, you're going to begin to see me begin to come and walk with you and make things happen. Let's stand on our feet and just thank God for this right now. Just stand up one minute and just lift your hands high. Psalm 121 said, look up to the hills from whence cometh your help. Your help comes from the Lord. The Lord says, get ready. Get ready for the visitation upon your house. Lift your hands and say, Lord, me, I'm right here. Don't pass me by. I'm not interested in it going to somebody else. I want it to happen for me. And the Lord says, get ready now. It's really coming forth. Thank you, Bishop. It's like I was here before. I felt like uh, there's another thing, like my feet had to step here again. You know, it's been a long time, but here we are. Lift your hands, the presence of the Lord is falling right now. Just receive the touch. Right now, let the mantle of his grace touch you right now. Can you feel, just right now, the atmosphere is changing. The presence of the Lord is falling right now. Get it right now. The Holy Spirit is coming into people. New impartations, new things are coming. God says, I'm going to bless you. Amen. I'm not done, but I'll stop. More later. I'm Thomas Mantle the Fourth. Can you stretch your hands out to this book? Amen. A new move is coming. 
And we have to grasp it. Amen.